always my favorite time of the night. Time for tonight's Hidden Gems, where we showcase little known or forgotten spots all across Cleveland for your family to rediscover this summer. And tonight, we're talking to the artist behind one of the more unique murals in Cleveland's Hingetown neighborhood. We're talking about the pizza mural. And News 5 photojournalist Bridget Pahoka found out this hidden gem will soon be lost forever. It really draws your attention to the one slice. It has that movement of the pizza sliding across the wall. The pizza mural is the genius of Mike Sobeck. It's kind of uh, a bummer that it has to go. Although Mike's work will never be stale, the side of the building needs some restoration work. It will alter the pizza mural to a point where we'll have to commission Mike Sobeck to do another brilliant work on the side of the wall. Yeah, it's not gonna be pizza though. Only he knows what will take the place of pizza mural. The spirit of the pizza mural will always be with this building. That pizza mural really like helped my art career way more than I ever thought it would. A few organizations came together to do a big mural project in Hingetown, and my name got mentioned as one of the local artists. When Mike painted the pizza on the side of this building, I didn't expect there to be droves of people who would come for a pizza pilgrimage. There was never a question for me that it was going to be a pizza mural. Who doesn't love pizza? At the time, I was just doing a lot of pizza art, so they kind of knew what they were getting when they asked me. It's actually a slice from Ohio City Pizza. Not many people know that. I smeared it on a piece of paper and took a picture and then that's like the basis of the pizza mural. This is the largest canvas that Mike has ever worked on and he knocked it out of the park. It's not quite photo realistic, but it's sort of like pop food art, I guess would be the best way to describe it. The guy is so talented. It seems like every year there's like a dozen new murals and it's, it's great for the city. I think it's an easy way to kind of bring a sort of dead area to life. It's sad to see like a, a piece that you made kind of go away, but I think why the pizza mural works so well is it's not an ad for a certain pizza place. Nobody knew it was even Ohio City pizza. It's just pizza. It's not so-and-so's pizza. You know, it's like a hot Instagram spot, but it's not an advertisement. It's a piece of art. There will be another pizza mural <laughs> one of these days. You know, it's just gotta be the right wall. <laughs> Drove by that mural the other day and almost hopped out to take a picture. Now I have to go back. <laughs> the building owner tells us there's still time to get your selfies in with the pizza mural this summer. The restoration work is set to begin sometime after Labor Day. And you can find Mike's mural at the corner of West 28th and Church Street. I'll have to head there and get that myself. You can check out the full list of gems at news5cleveland.com slash hiddengems.